Also in the news, Prime Minister of Dominica, Honorable Roosevelt Skerritt, is urging all those who borrow from financial institutions, particularly the Agricultural, Industrial and Development Bank, to make a more dedicated effort to repay their loans. The Prime Minister, speaking at the annual general meeting of the bank, explained how the aid bank functions, stating that it belongs to the state. And by virtue of it being a creature of the state, it means that all of the liabilities belong to the state. So for example, the bank borrows money from international regional financial institutions. In almost 100% of those cases, the loans must be guaranteed by the state with what is called a sovereign guarantee, which means, in essence, that if the bank fails or is unable to pay its creditors, then the Treasury of Dominica has a legal obligation to repay the sums borrowed by Scarrett stated that the government also provides direct financing to aid bank and made a direct plea to all those who have loan agreements with the bank to respect those agreements because delinquent loans affect the entire nation. Legal agreements. If we borrow, there is a responsibility to repay. And if you have, if you're experiencing difficulties in repaying, then you must go to the bank and engage the bank in discussions to see whether they can refinance or extend your loan repayments. But by neglecting the responsibility and being also publicly defiant of those, um, of your dereliction of, of responsibility and duty, is not sitting well with our country. Because you are in fact denying more job creation in the country. You're denying more entrepreneurs to be... Uh, the Prime Minister noted that the bank is in discussions with a bank over in China to borrow monies that would be a major plus to the Dominican economy as the bank will borrow at a 2% interest rate and lend to clients at no more than a 6% interest rate. 